we're featuring uh, Macau, and one of the landmarks here is the. Uh, there we go. It's right there. St. Paul's Ruins of St. Paul's. There, yeah, right it's there. Didn't expect to see it in the magazines. Aww. And then, when you saw it, it was very close. Amazing. Amazing. It's not like it's so big. It's not like it's so big. And that's the place. Wala. Just looking at it, it's kind of... I'm just like... Parang, I wasn't expecting, although it's quite near sa Pilipinas, para makita siya. Uh, parang, hindi mo kasi makapunta ng basta-basta. But when we got up here, wala. Parang, it's just stunning. So, one of the best times to come, to come up here is uh, about 3 to 4 in the afternoon where the sun shines towards the uh, facade. The view is just magnificent. I mean, you know, Okay, there's just simply lots and lots of people here, and people are still coming in. You know what? One thing what I want to do, dati pa, is just to sit here and watch people buy. You know, this is one thing that I'm really, really grateful for. For friends that I get to meet sa travel videos. Uh, okay, I, I just gotta mention this. Uh, thank you Arnold and family for just taking us here. For giving us a chance to uh, visit this place. Yeah, it's drama drama. Anyhow, another thing that I wanted to do is, uh, other than just sit here, relax and watch people buy, is to come up there and perhaps touch the walls of this uh, hundred or hundreds of years old the church so I just gotta touch the wall just to make give a feel of her parang ma feel ko lang yung gano siya katagal na talaga nun dyan so let's go up yeah, let's go all right so we made it up here and uh, okay I hope it is, well this is a dream come true, it's a, one of my little dreams, it's just to simply touch the wall of this um, very old church right here, yeah. somehow parang uh, touching it, na parang kasama ka sa part ng history of this church, napakatagal na talaga, you could feel the stone city is parang limestone, something or parang graphite, something. Ayan. Guard na ako. Baka niya ko yung pato. <laughs> okay, so you've seen uh, pictures of this before. It's a magazines. Let's go tour around. What's behind this thing? Okay. Dito wala siya masyado. There's a temple outside. And that's just about it. It's a wall with that thing supporting that big building. So you can see, yan lang yun, it, behind, if you go past through that wall, the big wall, the front, pinagkakagaloan ng mga tao. Yan lang, nasa likod niya. Uh, na. And then there's this tem small temple behind me. So we'll just take a visit. And then just uh, probably take a moment of uh, silence one place that we need to explore. Okay. And there 
there's not much to see except for a clothes shop that is closed and nothing much. So we just uh, looked at the uh, what's there, what's behind the wall, and we have the Yong Temple right there. Okay, so nakita nyo yung ligod nun, and uh, yeah, that's the one. Alright, now I'm finding my way going down. Dami tao pa rin. Maganda siya sa hapon. And, uh, oops, you gotta find my way up. Okay, I think I lost my friends the crowd. Okay, where could they be? Dami pa rin tao. Okay, they should be somewhere here. And we got to see our friends again. Dito. And before we may, ano, uh, before before we leave, definitely we have to try out Portuguese egg tarts. Portuguese egg tarts. <laughs> yeah, that's the one. Yeah. Let's see. Sample. Mmm, Miss World. <laughs> Sige, try natin. Parang egg daw talaga. <laughs> okay. So, nag-picnic na kami dito sa ano? Sa harap. Egg pa. Egg, egg tart. Portuguese. Authentic one. The real one. <laughs> Panalo. Very good. Portuguese egg tart. Is it the best? It is. <laughs> it was <a> bullet. <laughs> ah, panalo. Panalo. Eating egg tarts with the uh, ruins behind Arnold. 